hello everyone today i want to show you how to simplify this algebraic expression if we have 2 to the power of 21 minus 2 to the power of 20 we write this algebraic expression into the lowest form but here you remember one thing is that calculator is not allowed in this problem uh, this means that we will show all of the working on this paper so i hope so you like this method but if you have any other method in your mind so please don't hesitate to write this method into the comment section uh, now uh, the very first step we are going to do is here uh, first we uh, need to focus in the exponents of these terms uh, so here we break the exponent of the first term this is 21 we write it as 20 plus 1 minus here we write this is 2 to the power of 20 and now we use here uh, the nice exponent law you uh, very well know about this law if we have uh, a to the power of uh, m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n so according to this exponent law we will break the exponent of these two terms so after breaking the exponent uh, it will be written as 2 to the power of 20 multiplied by 2 to the power of 1 minus this is 2 to the power of 20 and now here in the next step you see here uh, 2 to the power of 20 be the common term so that we will take common 2 to the power of 20 here and we get the remaining values are here we get 2 minus here we get 1 only and now uh, when we uh, subtract 2 minus 1 we obtain here 2 to the power of 20 only okay so now here uh, in order to simplify our uh, given algebraic expression we need to uh, find the value of 2 to the power of 20 so now here again we break this 2 to the power of 20 as we write it as 2 to the power of 10 multiplied by 2 we know that 10 times of 2 becomes here 20 and here we again apply the exponent law you know that if in the exponent of uh, any number uh, the product of two digits so we can write it as a to the power of m to the power of n so according to this exponent law here uh, we move a 10 inside the term and it will be written as 2 to the power of 10 and its whole square so now here our first target is to find the value of 2 to the power of 10 then uh, at the last we can take the square of this number uh, so here uh, in order to find the value of 2 to the power of 10 uh, we uh, because calculator is not allowed in this problem so that we will show all of the working here uh, and now in the next step we first find the value of 2 to the power of 10 in this method so here uh, you very well know about that if you have 2 to the power of 1 it is equals to 2 and 2 to the power of 2 is equals to 4 2 to the power of 3 is equals to 8 so here you can just focus in the right hand side and you see here if you can get the next number you need to multiply the previous number by 2 similarly if you find the value of 2 to the power of 4 this means that we multiply 8 with 2 so 8 times of 2 becomes 16 and 2 to the power of 5 is equals to 16 times of uh, 2 becomes here 32 okay so uh, 2 to the power of 6 is equals to 32 multiplied by 2 becomes here 64 and here in the same pattern uh, you get the value of 2 to the power of 10 and we know that 2 to the power of 10 is equals to 1024 so now we replace this 2 to the power of 10 equals to 1024 so that our given expression is written as so when you put this value here it will become uh, 1024 whole square and now uh, here we need to break um, this base uh, so uh, here you see that this is the square and we know that the square of any number means that we can multiply uh, the number with itself so uh, 1024 square means that we multiply 1024 with 1024 and now here uh, you see that these are the bigger numbers and calculator is not allowed so uh, uh, here i can just give you a nice or smart method of multiplication in which you can multiply any bigger numbers without using the calculator or without any calculations 
so here uh, we consider uh, this is our uh, here first we can break this value as and we write first value as it is this is 1024 we write this value as 1000 and plus 20 and plus 4 so now uh, first we multiply 1024 on each of these values separately but now when you multiply this value uh, to 1000 we just place these three zeros here and it will be written as 1024 and we write three zeros here and we multiply this number with here it will becomes 1024 multiplied by 20 and plus we multiply 1024 with this 4 uh, and here uh, you see that 4 times of 4 becomes here 16 we write 6 and carry 1 and 4 2 is 8 8 plus 1 is 9 4 0 is 0 and 4 1 is 4 so you get here 4096 uh, and now here in the next step uh, we just uh, uh, first we can multiply these two numbers and at the last we uh, sum up all of these numbers okay so here uh, first we uh, multiply these two numbers and it will be written as one this is one zero two four and triple zero and plus here we consider this is one digit number and this is our two digit number and zero times of this number equals to zero and two times of this number equals to two fours are eight two twos are four two zeros are zero and two ones are two and plus here we have this is four zero and nine six so in the final step we uh, sum up uh, all of these three numbers so you see here zero plus zero plus six is equals to six 0 plus 8 becomes 8, 8 plus 9 becomes 17, we write 7 and carry 1, 0 plus 4 is 4, 4 plus 0 is 4, 4 plus 1 is 5 and 4 plus 0 is 4, 4 plus 4 is 8 and 2 plus 2 is 4, we write 4 here and then at the last we get these two values 1 and 0, okay. So finally we have uh, 2 to the power of 21 minus 2 to the power of 20 is equals to 1048576. So this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.